Michael Bogan your nose, mate. Me? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Get a tissue. Hello, welcome to the Stephen Troy's podcast, <laughs> series three, episode <laughs> nine. Yay! <laughs> I'm joined by Ryan Locke. Well, I'm not, but he's uh, he was sat here, but he had a bogey in his nose. Uh, uh. Two bogeyless boys are Tom Looney. Not so sure. <laughs> Looney. 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 Yeah, hello, Looney. And Max Smith. Hello there. Hey. hey. For viewers, we are not in the usual studio. No, uh, for no, listeners, no. it probably sounds shit, but, um, <laughs> but hey. We We're are in a cave. Yeah, we are in a cave. Uh, that works for um, what's the face um, the Taliban yeah they yeah. made videos from there they made lots of videos from the cave you've watched way too much it <laughs> seems <laughs> who uh, the Taliban uh, oh the Taliban sorry yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah fair Special guest today <laughs> yeah maybe <laughs> maybe hopefully not uh, so yeah we're, we're in a different room and for viewers we need to decorate really our yeah. side has the, the million plaque, 100,000 subscriber plaque. I need to get the other ones, you know, but yeah, one yeah. just fell down. And on your side, you have my lovely painting. Yep. Award winning work. mirror. Sexy work. Which yeah. I think gives off your vibe, you know, the sexual confusion on this side and success over here. Am I yeah, right? Yeah, damn right. Yeah. You didn't oh, get that bogey, did you? That's <laughs> no. I did. <laughs> So much to catch up on. So much. It's been an extra day than usual. Max, Hello. you left the country. <laughs> this I time, did, not yeah. in a balaclava on a speedboat. <laughs> <laughs> or was it? Uh, how was Paris? Really good. Uh, disgusting to be back, to be honest with you. Really? It was just, yeah, it was so wow. good just seeing, you know, all the sights. What are all the sights? The Louvre. Ooh. Uh, went up the Eiffel Tower, which is terrifying. Yeah. Well, you know, until I was going up the elevator... And it started shaking how scared I was of heights. <laughs> I was just there, like, when, when we got right to the top. Yeah. We went to, the, was it the second floor or yeah. the third floor? I was just sort of hunched <laughs> sort of against the wall, just like, I don't want to move. <laughs> and I, um, but, yeah, being on the top, because you, you can see to the horizon, yeah. you know. Have you ever... No, I've never been no, to I've Paris been. or France. Oh, fair, okay. Oh, I have been to France, actually. But never been to Paris. Yeah, it's just a, so, <laughs> it's a different world, man. What's the fashion like there? There's a lot, a lot more goths. Yeah, one yeah. thing I noticed. Uh, very hip, though. I think everyone takes fashion a lot more seriously over there. More than Ryan. He's got a Chris and D bag, definitely. Yeah. And a hanging bogey for accessories. <laughs> I haven't got a hanging bogey. I'm not even convinced that there was one. I think you're just saying it just to put me on edge. That's really upset me. <laughs> so on edge, mate. So on edge. We're all on edge, mate. <laughs> Every time you wave your head about, I just feel it. It's going to hit me. <laughs> just fall in debris. <laughs> uh, speaking of falling in debris. Hey! Yeah, yeah. Well, that's actually what he's going yeah, for. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what was your favourite meal in France? Do you know what? I tried snails. Oh, really? Which was very from strange. A, from a restaurant. <laughs> 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 You'll eat here tonight. You'll eat well. There's something in the garden. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> I've left me one at home. <laughs> yeah, from a restaurant. One thing you could bring from Paris to, let's say, Manchester. What Mona Lisa. Really? Why? Because there's a lot of money in it. I bet you bloody did. That's hey. what we're going to hang on that wall. Hey. Yeah. Imagine that. As the week's going, it's just more stuff we've stolen. Stephen said we had to. <laughs> yeah, customs. <laughs> it's for the podcast, I swear. Impressed you made it that far. The man at least is fine. Pretty incredible. <laughs> like, that's not, like, there's no shame in that whatsoever. It's broken into the loop. <laughs> One of the most amazing heists ever. And then it go through customs. Because he started crying. <laughs> Another part. <laughs> Ryan, you had yeah. a job interview, was it today? Yeah, yeah, I had an interview today. How did it go? Went very well. Um, got the job, yeah? I've got a trial. I don't know, it's not really a shift, a trial walk. Nice. Know, it's for Sorry. a tour guide position. <laughs> You're so, on trial, basically. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm going to go and join him for a walk in the Peak District in a few weeks' time. Yeah, fingers crossed it goes well. I hope I enjoy it, because uh, I wanted, would much rather do that kind of work so do you'd you much rather do a job you enjoy yes oh, does Dave know about yeah, this yeah, yeah. he does he does well so, so what's the what's the job so it's a tr sort of trainee tour guide six months uh, they do Where are you touring tours now? from Manchester to uh, Liverpool Oxford 
Chester, walk. Edinburgh, and then they do walking ones around Peak right. District and North Snow. <laughs> this is the M5. I was say, is that what's, what's in between Manchester and Liverpool? Warrington! <laughs> Look at this. Wow, an Ikea. You'll get lost in there, especially if I'm taking you. <laughs> Don't um, mind the bogeys. <laughs> So are you giving like information to <laughs> Yeah, taking people around, you know Oh that's mad. The city of Liverpool and <laughs> What do you know about Liverpool? <laughs> Nothing. Right. Don't know any uh, uh few hot spots to go to, I'd say Toxteth, Croxteth. <laughs> Just making uh, it No no no. Uh, yeah. Kens- have you heard of Kensington in London? Yes. It's very similar in Liverpool. Okay. Go there. Late right. at night. On your own with first. a bus full of, yeah, bus full of toys yes. <laughs> <laughs> and a nose full of bogeys. <laughs> <laughs> Thomas, what have you been doing? Devon um, had a. <laughs> she's doing intensive driving lessons at the morrow. Yeah, uh, at the morrow. <laughs> at the morrow. <laughs> at the morrow. <laughs> at the moment. Uh, I'm so learning she, Shakespeare as well. <laughs> yeah. So because uh, she's doing it obviously quite intensively, so she's doing long drives uh, to kind of mix it up. And her instructor was like, oh, "I want to, you know." take you on a longer drive because it'll be useful to you after your test so they went to St Helens uh, yeah went to St Helens <laughs> and the car broke yeah. down <laughs> <laughs> so she got stuck in St Helens for and three the people came out and started <laughs> stealing parts yeah. of the car, the car. <laughs> what is this object we will <laughs> some tricky roundabouts apparently yeah I failed on one yeah <sighs> in many ways it taught me a lesson that I never forgot which was handbrake don't drive into a lorry <gasps> they don't teach you that. <laughs> don't. Why leave it till the test? <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of which, I was uh, I was ill last night, and I've been ill for the past few days. Not bad, but last night, woke up at 3 a.m. Uh, with terrible stomach pain. Just like, oh, God. Ooh. I'm going to have to uh, razz. Um, so I went to the toilet and uh, trumping away. And nothing was changing. And then it got to 5 a.m., still on the toilet. I was like, oh, Jesus <sighs> Christ. Two hours on the toilet. Wow. I'm dead. Yeah. Oh, where to go? <sighs> Elvis. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Am I the modern day Elvis? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't want to answer that, but I'll let Ryan. No. <laughs> oh, fucking God. bang out of order, Shit, isn't it? You, kill you, me, man. you invite <laughs> somebody into your home. <laughs> I, I put on the furry lights for you. Yeah. Sorry. I thought I was being funny with. <laughs> You know the key to comedy is yes and yeah 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 <laughs> no yeah no no yeah yeah yeah, it's yeah yes yeah, and yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're so casual with it. Um, it's Mother's Day. Uh, well, it's already been when this goes out. But uh, aside from getting your fingers stinky, oh, <laughs> any plans? No. That was to Ryan yeah. as well. I must point out. <laughs> no, no plans. <laughs> so, so, so just that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I've sent a card and yeah. um, got my dad to buy a present. That's good me. of you, mate. Yeah, but yeah, we, we don't we don't really uh, do Mother's Talk. Day and Father's no. Day and, mm. and, and cards in general. We don't really do in our house. Um, I wouldn't expect your mum and dad to do it. Yeah, not for Mother's Day. Yeah, yeah. that's for you and your brother, really, isn't it? Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. The two of you just lazy, maybe. And you two have decided that's the thing we do. We don't do Mother's Day. Yeah, yeah. wow. No. You've well, decided no, that. Like I said, we've still we've still sent a card and things like that, but it's not like a an expected thing in our house. Oh, like she my gave mom, birth to you, I mean, man. yeah, I know. A, a yeah. piece of card with your writing on is not a present. Yeah. Yeah. She can't well, even read that. It's just a disappointing it's reminder. Not, it's not probably a bit of it. snot and bogey at the corner. <laughs> <laughs> no glue for stamp. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know what you want me to say to this. Just want you to be better, <laughs> man. Just yeah, be better. Be good, mate. Yeah, happy Mother's Day, Mum. Yeah. Oh, and she's been watching the podcast. You <laughs> she's said. still watching. The- <laughs> you said she's all caught up. Yeah, she, she's she's loved all it. Caught up. Yeah, yeah. Oh God. Hi, Mrs. Lock. Yeah. Hello. Hi, Mum. Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's yeah. Day, Carol. And to all mums, you made a good one. <laughs> Not this one. Stay away from my mum. <laughs> yeah. What else? Oh, complaints. Complaints oh, are brand no. new segment, <laughs> oh, uh, which has Christ. been going down a storm. I can't wait. <laughs> Uh, please take IMAX off. I've been listening to you since day one. And the more I hear it, the less brain cells I have. <laughs> <laughs> Next one. Uh, I have one complaint and one only. The podcast is perfect, of course, but I do think IMAX should be allowed more time. <laughs> Maybe allowing Max to review each segment would be for the best. Cheers, guys. <laughs> See, this is this is what we have to deal with. Everyone's all over the shop. This one I agree with. Yeah. Joe shouldn't be on the pod unless it's a special. Max, Stephen and Tom should be on every week with the other three switching. That's pretty much what we've been doing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you want to keep up? Just making sure. <laughs> I like your podcast, but happy hour is shit. I know that's not related, but you should be more specific in your email names. Yeah, it's called uh, it's called Podcast Complaints. That's a good one. That's a good one, that. I still can't believe we got that. Yeah. That's, no, that's a insane. real coop. Yeah. It was quite a long one that I really enjoyed. Max and Looney's Dirty Secret, it's called. 
The sexual tension between Max and Looney is unbearable. Max is yearning for Tom's meat banister, and it's so clear to see. The way Max always argues with Looney reminds me of a woman in her 60s who's frustrated that her husband can't spell his plums no more. <laughs> Looney clearly wants it as well, and he's always giving him the eyes and tense in his biceps. <laughs> Dread to think what happens when the cameras go off. Just imagine those two dry humping on the table while, while Steve watches in horror. <laughs> Ryan sits in the corner, crying with shit dribbling down his leg. Bogey's going for his nose. <laughs> <laughs> And Joe recorded with his flip phone in his left hand <laughs> and his little soldier in his right hand. Um, Thank well, you very much, Ollie. Um, yeah, embarrassing for Joe, spot though. Spot on. Spot on. <laughs> Shit dribbling down his leg. That's why we had to move studios. <laughs> oh, God. Just dribbling. <laughs> You are a mucky boy. Yeah. You are, aren't you? Um, now time for the news. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Catherine Tate has a new comedy on Netflix, Hard Sell. A documentary crew follows the inmates and staff of HMP Waldsley, while Catherine Tate portrays multiple characters to capture the penal system and its brutal humorous best. Oh. Catherine Tate multi-rolling. Yeah. <laughs> we love nostalgia. How is that getting made? Is it good? <laughs> no reviews are allowed of it. And the director's oh, really? had the name, uh, the name removed from. <laughs> oh, oh fucking God. hell! Joe, you know Catherine Tate's. I've never like gone back to watch Catherine Tate. So like Little Britain, maybe not so much Little Britain, but Come Fly with Me. I've gone back and like watched it over the years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that the racist Tate, one. Just never. Uh, <laughs> prob- yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, don't don't listen to him, Ryan. It's tasteful blackface. Yeah. yeah we got no coffee. <laughs> <laughs> What's she like? Yeah. Oh God. Uh, but Catherine Tate never gone back to watch. I Did you enjoy it the first time round? Yeah, loved it. Loved it. First time round. Oh, okay. First time this round. Is a, this is a confused remember, review, uh, isn't it? The, the, the nan and. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can't just name characters. We just mentioned. The nan. Yeah. There was that one that was like <laughs> Mr. Uh, Bean. I want to say. Dear me, dear gay, dear no dear. Remember that? <laughs> but he, he wasn't that funny. <laughs> Was that? Uh, well, oh, wow. Was it, was it the bald guy? Yeah. It was, yeah. It was just a closet homosexual. Yeah. How very yeah. dare you? How very dare you? Imagine this on the streets of Liverpool. Who did, me did, gay did, no did. Uh, the Tate Modern. Is this Tate? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Am I bothered? Am I bothered? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was getting. Confused. Who could forget? Yeah. Yeah, was she wasn't bothered. That was good. Uh, she was modern. reckless. Computer says no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot yeah. about that as well. It's the wrong one, Ryan. Computer says no. It's little Am Britain. I bothered? That's Little Britain. Oh, shit, yeah. It's, no. no it? Yeah, but no, but is uh, Little Britain. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, different it's... jokes, but really well done, so you've got to yeah. remember what, which one. was that Vicky Pollard, wasn't it? No, 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 no that's, that's, that's yeah, but no, like, but... It's, well, it's Catherine Tate, but she's like, kind of got big hoop earrings and... Oh, ponytail. is it? Oh, so, yeah, but I'm a bothered, though. Oh, it is, isn't it? Oh, God, I fucking hate all that. Wacky catchphrases. Yeah, you're right, yeah. Can't wait to watch that, though. It's now time for... Max's Football Roundup. Max's Football Round. Max. Hello. We are down to the semi finals of the FA Cup. Yes. Who's going to win the trophy? Pompey. Pom- Pompey. <laughs> Another bold shout. Yeah, I'll do. What was it like when Portsmouth won it back in 2008? Uh, I don't really remember. Um, I know it's busy shagging. <laughs> yeah, man. The trophy. Yeah. Take it off. Yeah. <laughs> so he paraded it throughout the streets. <laughs> Just you inside it. <laughs> Shaking around. <laughs> I'm coming. Um, yeah, no, it was... Uh, it was it's firing out of the trophy. <laughs> <laughs> Is this confetti? <laughs> anyway. Um, Jermaine Defoe retired. Uh, was it today, yesterday? Yeah, yeah. Was it, yeah? Yeah. Well, Pops with the your heroes. What did he uh, retire for? Fed up of football. He was, he was playing in Sunderland. Yeah. Oh. Sick of that. Jesus Christ. Who could yeah. blame him? Favourite player. <coughs> Jermaine Defoe. Really? Player. I should have said. Why did you lie? <laughs> <laughs> it's not really a lot. Uh, His dad's Willem dad's. Defoe. <coughs> that was Max's football <laughs> round. <laughs> uh, it's now time for another segment. Let's have it. Did you hear what that loony bloke just said? Yeah, boy. Uh, this week's news is gossip at its finest. Mm. Kylie Jenner revealed that her son's name is no longer Wolf because her and Travis Scott just really didn't feel like it was him. So they changed it. Hi, 
boy, did you hear what that loony bloke just said? Didn't hear that, did we? Oh. Jingle was playing. Yeah, hopefully not. What did you say? <laughs> they changed it to Fox. Yeah, do you like foxy little kids, do you? <laughs> Creep. <laughs> the fiddler strikes again. <laughs> Gonna give you a tour of a uh, strange ways. Yeah. Yeah. Meet Catherine Tate. Yeah. God. Lock her in a cell and throw away the key. <laughs> uh, it's now time for you laugh, you lose. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> Ryan, I must say that we need to make the rule: you can't look away. Okay. We need to watch Ryan. Okay. And enjoy it. You ready? Yeah. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Welcome to Impressions with me, Ryan. First impression, <laughs> uh, Rob Bryden. <clears throat> I love them. Second impression, Tom Shelby. <laughs> <laughs> Thomas Shelby. It's Tommy Shelby. Tommy, Tom Shelby. <laughs> Tim Shelby. <laughs> <laughs> you two both definitely went before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've made us all laugh. Oh, right. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 no. Can we see it? 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 Go on. Can we see it? Tom Shelby. As if they got you with that. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Did you, did you plan to get his name wrong? Uh, I planned to do bad impressions. Yeah. I didn't necessarily plan to get the name wrong. For fuck's sake. <laughs> That's what can can we see Tom Shelby? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Where's my whiskey? That's Arthur. Where is he? God. Yeah, it's Arthur, mate. I wish I'd waited. Yeah, no, I know. I wouldn't have laughed. I think though. that would have brought it's you right upset back. It's upsetting. It's upsetting when that happens. <laughs> <laughs> but again, you got it wrong. So. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that might have sent me. <laughs> whiskey. I don't know if it's me or you. I think it's you. Uh, do you know, I've, I've got to do one anyway. Yeah, so. do one anyway. Yeah. yeah. Well done, Ryan. Thank you. Um... Now on to the world of punishments. We don't have any punishments today. We're going to save it for the 100th episode, which is uh, coming up fast. Oh, wow. Is it? I think so. It might be today. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. God, help, this is <laughs> Everyone just runs <laughs> on the cupboard. <laughs> you may recall that Tom, Max, Very Ryan, and myself uh, are all being punished. Yeah. Dave also. Yeah. So Cameron, only, Cameron so, we agreed well, on. Cameron, yeah. But then I received a call last night from Cameron, uh, who was furious and threatened me and threatened Tom okay. that is not okay no. I said Cameron you know I'm being punished and he went what and then he played the video on a bit longer and realised that I too mm. was being punished right. felt some sort of remorse mm. still I received this voice message which I'll uh, I'll play now Umpa Lumpa oh wait that wasn't it <laughs> Duperty Dingus I'm gonna slot you on right in your ringus yeah. Threats wow. are not tolerated on this podcast unless they're two other podcasters. Cameron is now going to receive the most severe punishment. Yeah, possible. man. He's got to dress up like an Oompa <laughs> Just banned forever. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. That's what he wants. I'm going to start threatening everyone now, man. <laughs> now for the talking points. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the one thing you wish to accomplish before you die? <laughs> wish. So it could be anything. It, even... Outside the realms of possibility. So many wishes. No, come on, man. Wish. Hey, hey, get your head screwed on, man. Things, they? Oh, no, but it's going to be... I a wish I was Frodo Baggins. Great, great. That's a wish, isn't it? Yeah, I, know, I guess it is. It's shit, though, isn't it? <laughs> Imagine watching Fairly Odd Parents and everything he wishes for is just realistic stuff. But that's not... I wish I had a roast dinner. All right, mate. It goes wrong sometimes. Isn't okay, it? right, that's fine. Frodo Baggins. So, you're, one else? so you want to be Frodo <laughs> Baggins? Well, no, I, I, I wanna, wanna, that's fine. I, I, that's fine. I want to live forever. We're, 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 no, we we'll move on. Uh, live forever as Frodo Richard Baggins. Wealthy. That's yeah, fine. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Boom. Frodo Baggins. Don't want to die. What do I wish for? I think uh, just any <laughs> TV line. Just, TV line? Just to be on TV and say a line. To have a line on fucking <laughs> just TV. Just to have a line. Yeah, but like... Well, that's you know, realistic though, isn't it? things that I'd want, but that is something yeah. I'd really, you know... Pints of bitter, please. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do it! I would be happy with that. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> Even if it made zero content. Like it went that way! Yeah. <laughs> In the show. Who, me? <laughs> you're, at, you're at a funeral scene. <laughs> And then you just walk in, bounty bitter, please, Maggie. <laughs> You'd be happy with that. Yeah. You can, you can clearly see the other yeah. the other characters just mouthing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Paying yeah, yeah. his respects, having coffee. Well, we had a party back, back. Like, that's yeah. me, that. I wouldn't yeah. go in there, mate. 
what about what about if it was line of duty yeah and they finally work out who's the who's the whole head honcho of the thing oh. and it's just it's you and they're going this massive pedophile here <laughs> <laughs> he's the kingpin of all the pedophiles it's just your face on the whiteboard yeah and then you 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 come on screen and go boys gotta eat <laughs> <laughs> make a living <laughs> h stands for horny <laughs> I, I, yeah, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, okay. I would still do it. Yeah, yeah. Oh God, really? Do what if it's on to catch a predator? <laughs> Maybe not anything. <laughs> <laughs> to catch a predator. Catch a predator. <laughs> and you're just there going, I'll never tell. <laughs> That's your one line, Ryan. <laughs> Starting to regret my choice now. Uh, so we got I think uh, it's Frodo stupid. Baggins, one line on TV. <laughs> so what is it? Uh, what was the question? <laughs> one, one, one thing, one, I really one 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 thing to accomplish before you die. <laughs> We've got Max's transition to Frodo Baggins. So you're gonna, you're gonna lose height. <laughs> you you have to be so. smaller. Yeah, but not mass. <laughs> so that's just a question. No fat jokes, please. That's not yeah, fat jokes. No that was one of the. That was one of the that's complaints we've had. It's not fat jokes. In just saying like. To be squashed down. Yes. Oh, you'd obviously yeah. expand a little bit. Yeah, I've got, would I? You yeah. wouldn't. Anyone would. You wouldn't. Any Who's, fucker would. Who's nah, putting the complaints make. in a team? Simple science, mate. It's simple science. Physics. Yeah, simple science from a simple, simple fucking science. brain. <laughs> and like Mike Wazowski. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fucking Frodo would have to deal with this bullshit. <laughs> Save me love, it's man. It's Frodo magic. Yeah. Uh, no. It's <laughs> just <laughs> quiet, though. Big feet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Freddo. <laughs> Freddo Baggins. Freddo, Freddo Shaggins. Yeah, that's me, man. The Ports with Trust. <laughs> hey, everyone. It's Freddo Shaggins. <laughs> He's eating fucking snails at the bin. Oh, it's like Paris in my mouth. <laughs> well, what about you, Stephen? Oh, good question. One man. wish, baby. <laughs> One thing I want to accomplish before I die. Uh, I want a family. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, guys. And we like that. I too. mean, I mean, like, uh, sure, yeah, but um, uh, kids, really? kids, not okay. in the same way this guy does <laughs> in that hit show. I want to see, I want to see my little kids grow up, and you're there going, yeah. "Oh, never mind that. Watch me. <laughs> Fuck them off, mate. I've got me one line. <laughs> this is me on Total Wipe. Um, no. <laughs> I'm <to visit> please. <laughs> <laughs> <Don't keep laughs> <me out. laughs> you think I had a makeup and say something? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <for God's> sake, <laughs> Clearly, cut your mic as you're ranting <laughs> off. <laughs> Imagine getting the script and having to read that line. <laughs> it's not scripted, man. So, why was it scripted? <laughs> Then you'll come on the greatest you drama on television. <laughs> the best one would be if you're in Piggy Blinders and you just go, you must be Tom Shelby. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have a whiskey, please. <laughs> yeah. oh, uh, Tom, play, play pe- a professional pe- football pe- People game. know about me that I want to travel the world, uh, so I would like to kind of... In a certain amount of time? Yeah, certainly. But I think before I'm 40, I want to get a lot under my belt, uh, see, a lot, see a lot of the world. Wow. Um, just have a good time with it. Ten years? Yeah, ten years. Well, Nine. Shit. Nine and a half, mate. Eight what and a half. Why don't you become like Eight a half. travel vlogger? <laughs> Keeps going down. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it does. <laughs> a travel yeah. vlogger. Yeah. It just seems like the piss easy job. I'll have, do you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll have a like little, little Regrets in Paris. Yeah, because I've, a number of things I've thought about doing and, you know. I'm sure there's people that watch this. I've fucking done or, anything, have I? like a so. bit of that. Hi, guys. Yeah. I forget to speak to the viewers sometimes. And the listeners. Still yeah. here. Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> Is your one line? Can we cut that out, please? <laughs> Already done, baby. There's <laughs> one line. You could just do him in the background. <laughs> Excuse me, when's my part? I've <laughs> <laughs> in the trailer for eight hours. <laughs> you could be a top boy. You said you've been watching that yeah, recently. Yeah, top oh. boy. Yeah. Yeah. Could you be a drug dealer or? Uh, probably more of a victim. Is that what that show's <laughs> about? What? Drugs. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Man, I got overpriced. <laughs> Excuse me, I'll give you two twenty. <laughs> can I get can I get a score? <laughs> oh. I'd like to master a skill. Like Which a, one? So piano? Well yeah, well I mean an, an instrument is one that I would like a the guitar. Yeah, the guitar. I could teach you drums <laughs> <laughs> to the guitar. Yeah, that'd be nice. Do that while you're travelling. It's all the same shit I've been working on for some time. <laughs> just, I bet you, man. It's fucking you pathetic, there man. with guitar, though. If yeah, I, yeah, like, obviously, break my hand in now, but I'm, yeah. uh, you know, playing it again. It's all right. If I offered you either you play 
a professional game in the Premier League yeah. or you travel around all of South Africa, what would you pick? <sighs> Playing a professional game in the Premier League. Yeah. Am I any good? Yeah, you're in goal. <laughs> goal. Oh, man. You're, you're next tied to the goalpost. <laughs> <laughs> you're doing a great job, man. <laughs> is that what you think playing is? <laughs> Go and play with your friends. All right. <laughs> I've done it too tight. <laughs> this is where it's meant to be fun. <laughs> um, you must have bigger dreams than that, right? I mean, I think Fucking that's a pretty big so. dream. <laughs> Just Fucking so you want a part in a show, like you're know, the, yeah, the oh, leading oh, man. A part, then. I, I wouldn't want to be a leading man. No, no. Of course no. you would. <laughs> a recurring would character. Like, yeah, a recurring character. <laughs> Another pint of bitter yeah. booze. <laughs> Every episode. <laughs> I was here last week, don't you remember? <laughs> the usual. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, just to be happy in a show. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it out. Fuck the line. <laughs> just want some respect. <laughs> I just want a smile. <laughs> <laughs> These drugs aren't doing it. <laughs> yeah, just have a, a job that I'm happy in. And, yeah. Uh, can, you know, live off it. <laughs> so you want to accomplish... Because <laughs> so, that's not a job, is it? A one, one line, one time. A, a reoccurring character might be a job. Well, so what, a job, but, what know, do you want uh, to accomplish, though? Accomplish? Just... Yeah. just so Max no. wants to be Frodo Baggins. <laughs> just... Yeah. Uh, Tom wants to do uh, I want to accomplish uh, a, a paid comedy role... Nice. In a film or at least a recurring series. What about an advert? Yeah, actually, you're an advert or a big advert. Actually, I've had one line in an advert. advert. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) Okay. What about if somebody got confused by what you said there and then when they heard comedy roll, they thought you meant like a slapstick fall? Yeah. (laughs) And it's just you in an advert doing a fall down a hill and they all just go, never mind him. Yeah. I mean, I'd definitely do it, but I wouldn't, when they say cut, I wouldn't think, yeah, "Yeah, dream's complete. (laughs) I'm done, baby. Okay, well, you, you, get, you get the line, uh, but it's like on a live show, right. and you absolutely fucking butcher it, yeah. and that's it. You're off, and that's it done. <laughs> right. One of your eyes is so clearly you, looking at the yeah. camera. <laughs> <laughs> you trump, and then, then you definitely shit yourself. It's shit very down obvious. My leg and well, no, it doesn't go down your leg, but you're like, oh, no. oh <laughs> you run up bogeys. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> you run a bogey. Yeah, you you sort of uh, you had a, a big thing for climbing mountains. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did. Uh, yeah, maybe another mount. Oh, it's a, no, no. Maybe maybe you get to the top of Everest and do a comedy line. It's high up here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. A pint of this. <laughs> <laughs> Too cold. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to do another mountain. You know, yeah. on the sort of Kilimanjaro scale. What about the um, mountain? What about do it yourself this time? Just like getting a local to do it yeah. for you. <laughs> <laughs> Carry your own back. Yeah. Or come up with your own dreams, mate. Don't let us suggest them. Right. Yeah, man. Maybe that I'm, could be a dream. Climb a mountain, yeah, fine. Lots of dreams, Why not? Lots, lots of things. Name I three. Want to do. Name, all right, so we've already mentioned an acting. <laughs> no, you role. can't have you one. You can't have the same dream. You, it. you okay. said you've got loads, so I'm not having one right. fucking repeated. Okay, then. I want to be able to buy my own house one day. <laughs> no, my own no. flat. Oh. A bachelor pad? Yeah. Uh, yeah, kids. yeah, that, that's that's fucking exciting. Yeah, you know what? yeah, man. yeah. If I've got the money from this one line, I've got. I forget I'm about that. Man. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's I'd go down a different path yeah. to get the money. Um, okay, I would like to get fit as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, already no. done that, mate. Uh, Damn. Damn. Yeah. Is that your bogey hat? Uh, <laughs> when you say fit as fuck, fuck, you mean like uh, in good I shape mean, or just yeah, like really, just, really uh, sexy? Just, just get uh, really lot, sexy. Yeah, just get. Just a, yeah, yeah, mate. People Big look breasts. at me and go, "Oh, he's been working out." Yeah, no. but if you carried your own bag up Kilimanjaro, you could have been that, mate. Yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> I did carry uh, my own bag up Kilimanjaro. Yeah, it's just a, uh, <laughs> is that the bogey again? Gonna carry these fuckers up. No one else is going to do it for me. Yeah. It's all right, mate. Yeah. Any more? Bill. Was that third? Maybe cooking more, like to do a bit more like... Oh, okay, yeah. I, I just finished that. That's fine. Done. You know, it's, yeah. not, it's not a dream. It's yeah. just... <laughs> I want to master the stir yeah. fry. It was your third wish, though, wasn't it? Maybe cook some more. <laughs> yeah. Sure. yeah. Yeah. The end of Aladdin. <laughs> What's your final wish, Aladdin? <laughs> for a cook more, mate. Just, like, just browse the menu, Maybe. Please. I don't know. Uh, just, I don't it's know. A couple of nights a week. <laughs> but like from scratch, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, yeah man. like when you get a. You can do that. Hello, Fresh Box. Like <laughs> that kind of thing. Like that kind of from scratch. Mm. So just go, go to the supermarket and buy some raw ingredients, you know? Yeah, yeah. Round of your own. Yeah, it's good Thank to have you. dreams. Thank yeah. you, everyone. You've got lots of dreams. Yeah. Do you know what Frodo bag is looking so bad now? <laughs> You're silly, man. Yeah. Um, I'd I'd want to uh, I'd want to write, perform, and direct something where I multi-role every Dude. part. Really, well, you want to play all the roles. Yeah, and it's yeah. 
Just gonna, a little bit. I'm gonna take yeah, on. Yeah. I'm gonna take on the prison life, but yeah. uh, never as as before seen. <laughs> <laughs> to all the different gangs, you know, the African Americans, yeah, 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 the yeah. Mexicans. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got to deal with the Latinos, man. <laughs> Skinheads. Yeah. Yeah. If you had to be in a gang in prison, who, do, who would you go for? I don't want to be with the skinheads. No. Um, nah, I feel like I wouldn't I'd, agree with them. Mm. I'd be fucked. Oh, really? Yeah. It's one way to get in a gang. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Just the cool gang. The cool gang. The cool gang. The cool gang. The cool okay. gang. I didn't even think I'd of that as an option. Like, yeah. Yeah. I'd probably be hanging out around. Just the, the, the jocks, the man. Yeah. <laughs> I, think, uh, I think people would be hanging out of you, mate. <laughs> I just go, go to the library and hang out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the library. To keep myself to myself. Just do my book time. jokes. Do my yeah. time. Read yeah. your boxing books. Yeah. <laughs> You're allowed to delete one thing from the universe without any negative consequences. What do you delete and why? Not this podcast, okay? God, the universe is a big place. Yeah. I'm going to focus on Earth probably just because I don't know too much about. Uh, yeah. I would like to get. I don't uh, delete Jupiter. <laughs> Q- yeah, Ryan. Oh, delete queuing. Queuing. Cumin. If I was to delete queuing, like you know, wow, like, chaos, mate. having to go into a queue. Yeah, God. Yeah. So you just give like everyone just attacks it. No, yeah. we can we can all just go straight through. They'll just I be mean, full though. Yeah, but like, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. Queuing has got a reason. This is how there's there's four cashiers on. Yeah. So there's lots of repercussions there's for my decisions. It would just be all out anarchy without any negative consequences though. So you're going for queuing. Yeah. So you just. So you so much more time to learn your line. Yeah. yeah. That's clever that mate. I'm gonna delete Ryan's line. <laughs> <laughs> Backspace baby. I'm gonna delete Ryan. <laughs> I wouldn't do that, mate. I feel like Thank a wasted you. mind then. No. <laughs> Travel fees. <laughs> yeah. Or fees, money. I get rid of money. Yeah. Yeah. Then how how do we No negatives, baby? Just... So like uh Noel Edmonds swap shop. Yeah, it'd be good. How did people pay for things back in the day? Well, trade and trade, trade, and first, trade yeah. services for like, you know, you scratch my back. I'll give you some turkey meat. Wow. <laughs> That's how we met. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to give me, man? <laughs> I feel like I've just been mugged off there. Yeah. So oh, listen, me. listen to how I scratched Ryan's back you're and I received, scratching your back. I received nothing but a weird look. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's arrogant. You are, 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 are going to be dead My before you know it when all you give in return to people is, uh, Thank you, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for scratching my back. Humble man's just giving you turkey meat. Yeah, Do you not hear what he said? What would you like in return? Stephen's the one that scratched your back. Why are you asking me? Oh, that's why you were scratching my... I, I just thought you were just, just scratching. What do you think? Weird, mate. Yeah. Sorry, apologies. Weird. Great yeah. new segment. Yeah. You made it weird. You scratched my back. And then, you know, <laughs> nothing. Nothing. <laughs> nothing happened. Just Ryan's deaverish commands. Scratching it back. No, he's a back scratcher, so in, in, yeah, in kind of... Do, yeah, that's what he does. He doesn't need oh, that. He travels, yeah. <laughs> travels the yeah. land. My fingernails are insured for so much money, man. Yeah. yeah. Well, no money. Price so much turkey, mate. So, so many sprouts. <laughs> so, oh, what else can we delete? I have to delete alcohol. Oh, so then when yeah, you have it, no. everyone just has to have a good time without the... Uh, yes, drugs oh, would be alcohol. Oh, oh shit, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I just I wish I didn't drink. Or the, the negative effects of alcohol. Yeah. That'd be great. Yeah. Pain yeah. and suffering. Hangovers. Get rid of hangovers. Oh, that's a great yeah. one. Yeah. You get, wow. You get bad, yeah. Bad hangovers. Not really, but Mine I again. have done in the past. Mine are getting worse. I'm very moany. <sighs> yeah. You drink last night, did you? No. <laughs> Brilliant. Cheers, man. Yeah. No, but I am very like. But I'm going to drink today. Not good for hangovers at all. Yeah, at yeah. all. Did you see the Moni Lisa in Paris? Nice. Yeah. <sighs> Let down by that. So we've got hangovers. What are you get? Uh, wealth inequality. I guess, I guess. Yeah. I mean, I kind of want to get rid of like historical landowners, people that just got, inherited. Yeah. Yeah. Just get rid of it. Yeah. I mean, I get, you know, family. I like people to own their own. So that island where the the tribe live that I've never seen anyone else. Would you say that's everyone's now? Oh, they're going to be it's a tricky one, isn't it? But you know, you you, you know, you know the people I'm coming after. I guess if I can give this rule, but then I'd obviously go over it myself with a fine tooth comb and make decisions. I'll make them. You're making. I'll, them. I'll take. Wow. This out. I'll you, take get, this out. you could get rid of billionaires. Give myself the land. <laughs> <laughs> Think about how much money you'd get if you yeah. you've got rid of billionaires. Yeah. yeah. Just Over a, a billion, yeah. Oh. Just yeah, a, a, a wage cap, full stop. For all what, what if you what if you see yourself coming up to that wage? You know, yeah. What if you could do so well with this travel vlog? Yeah, 
you see yourself make it? What what do you cap it at? Well, I mean, if I'm doing really well, then the it's not kind of money. It's not about the money, is it? You know, <laughs> sounds like I'm having a great time. I'll be fuming if I get to like ten billion. And I'm like, really? I can't make any more because you're not letting ten me. billion, and he's angry. Oh, furious. It's sad, isn't it? It's sad. <laughs> so we're getting rid Q-in. of hangovers. Uh, Q in. Q in. And money. And inherited land. land. Yeah. Okay. Well, sure. we're, we're really shaking the world up then. Yeah, yeah. man. <laughs> I knew it was a Q in. <laughs> that was a wait for anything. <laughs> if Mars was habitable, would you accept a one way ticket there? Oh. Think of the travel vlogs. <laughs> that one travel vlog. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> he that turns up. Pint, please. <laughs> No, <laughs> you're here too. <laughs> I'm fit as fuck on Mars. <laughs> <laughs> the bloke going his back. <laughs> you can go now. I'd hate it. I think <clears throat> stuck on Mars. Yeah, uh, it'd be si- like sick in terms. You know, if it was just a yeah, man, world. for oh. the Instagram. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> all you'd be would be doing is just surviving. I know that's technically what we do now. We just, oh, that's yeah. so powerful, man. Yeah, man. Like, you would be on that good cush tonight, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> You'll be on Mars. What? Hey, it depends on. I wouldn't want to be the first. No, because it, it would just be like one of those sort of a base, like, like a mobile. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It'd be so it'd be shit. Like a... If you if you're bad with the heights of the Eiffel Tower, <laughs> you're flying up there. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, take me back. <laughs> be good then. Yeah, it, it's one of the. I wouldn't want to be the first. Yeah, if there was like a society up there, then maybe. Yeah. But six people. No. Mars, are you going? I don't think I would. Um, I, I, <sighs> if you travel the world yeah, by I forty, travel the world, and and I agree with I agree with my boy Smith over it. I need I need a bit of something going on up there. Yeah, I need some Mars culture. Yeah. Yeah. Start the Mars Football League. Yes. Start oh, the Mars yeah. Defence League. Best footballer on Mars. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The Mars Defence League. <laughs> Someone's got to do it. Yeah. yeah, man. Would you be annoyed if you got there and then the next person to get off was Stephen Yaxley, whatever his name is? Yeah. Lennon. It's just Would I be annoyed, yeah. Or Tommy Robinson. No, I'd be fuming. Would you be more annoyed if you got along with him? If you just if you just go into bed at night, guys, it's not bad, you know. He gets a bad rap. <laughs> you would have to, I think. If you'd have you, to get if along. It's just you two. Yeah. You'd have to become friends with him. Yeah, yeah. just the two of you. Just the two. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Crikey. To repopulate, wouldn't you? Yeah, man. So who's going to Mars? <laughs> just Ryan, I think. No, no, I'm Ryan. Not going. Yeah. Just, no we're one of us yeah, has to go, going. Ryan. Yeah. Yeah. One of us has to go. Got to yeah. promote the podcast up there. <laughs> oh, I've got. I've got to stay here. <laughs> I've just I've just sorted this room so I can't yeah, really yeah. leave. It'd be ridiculous not, if like, you alternate yeah. like a year at a time. Yeah, Plus yeah, that, you, yeah, know, you like go I've first. Got, I've, yeah. I'm in a relationship and says Max and stuff. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've just come back from Paris, so I need to sort of acclimatise to Manchester yeah. again. Yeah, that's she's true. got jet lag. Yeah, man. Your ears might pop. Oh, why well, oh, bring it up ears? No, it would ruin my ears. Yeah, imagine yeah. mine. Flew to God, yeah, yeah. Please slow down the spaceship. Mm. <laughs> Remember the wind resistance on these? Yeah. yeah. Never get there. Think about these things. Now we have a great fucking segment. Yeah. yeah. It's Stephen Lies, I think. Stephen Lies. Stephen Sweet Little Lies. Oh, yeah. He's proper fit and gives me a wide on. For listeners at home, uh, Max is detective. And <laughs> we have an item this week. Wow. It's a little, little award, not a text. I guess we've given up on the... No, no, it's still a good format. Oh, can I have a look at it, please? Cheers. Nope. Nice. <laughs> Cheeky. Hey, winning the Great Egg Challenge. That's impressive. Uh, 7th of February, 2007. Uh, so good times. Yeah. It's a long time ago, isn't it? Nah, nah, many, nah, nah. Many moons ago. Not in here. So this is at home. Max is playing Fif- with his fingers. <laughs> 15 years ago. So you'd have been 15? Nope. 17? 17? You're not going to get that at 17. What was that? What year? 2007? Oh, yeah. 2007. I was 12. And you would have been 12 uh, as well. Actually, I was, I was 11 at the time. 11. 17. 11. I'm going to focus more on you two because there's no way Tom won the great fucking egg challenge at Ooh. 17. <laughs> do, you want to, do, do you want to hear my story? Yeah, go on. Okay. I assume you worked hard on it. So I did work experience at Hazel Grove in, when I was 16. Okay. Did that in year 11. Yep. I don't know if you did that, but it's kind of around the time that you do it. No, I did it. I've uh, spoken about it before. Yeah, so uh, I did really well there. Um, got on quite well. And they asked me to come back the next year for two weeks. Two weeks to a primary school as a stranger. Oh, come on back, Tom. You did a really good job. I was there for two weeks. It's work experience. And they asked you to keep coming back? No, they asked me to come back for another two weeks. Really? Next year. Defend yeah. his egg champion yeah. title. 
Very strange that. Why? Why is it strange? Oh, because you've got your life to live. You're there for work experience. You know, no, they, they tell them to use their fucking budget at the time. Uh, at the time, uh, you know, <laughs> not to time. get some weird fucking egg boy, <laughs> man, <laughs> egg man. <laughs> I wasn't. <laughs> they, they weren't depending on me. You know, it was <laughs> shock horror. The egg boys don't turn up. They gave me the opportunity to come back at the start of the. As a vegan, turn. you should you should hate this. Anyway, we did. Uh, eggs. So the, for, for, the, for the time I was there, we'd had this egg challenge thing that we did. Uh, that everyone, I think, you had know, like you got a pack of eggs. Everyone got a pack of eggs and a lot of eggs, uh, and you had to do various kind of things with them. One was like the um, where you throw them at the fucking egg boy. Where making it making it float, <laughs> uh, make it, getting rid of the shell, yeah, putting yeah. In vinegar and making the egg bounce. There was like building a. That's, that's a real thing. Yeah, no, I know it is. Man. Building a contraption so that you could drop it at the end of the week, and we saw whose eggs survived. Basically, I won. Um, so well, you, you so beat all these kids. I, I, I did win. Uh, so another kid got the, the the kid that won got one of these, but they also gave me one uh, as well as a card and some chocolates it, and stuff. All right, Ryan, what's this to you? Uh, it's um, an awards. There was a day where uh, I think it was a school trip. People went out to like Thought Park. Thought um, Park. Okay. I I didn't go because I hate roller coasters. So one of the things more we did at theme park, in, mate. Um, in science was the uh, the Great Egg Challenge. We had to throw um, an egg off the top of the uh, building and try and not make it crack. And catch it at the bottom. No, he went down the stairs, it. didn't you? You, you got it. given like so four pieces like 14, of. Yeah. yeah. So, okay, cool. Yeah. Four pieces of uh, like newspaper. Yeah, this sounds like something you do in primary school, not yeah. in, uh, <laughs> you know. It was in secondary school, it was in. Uh, yeah, that's what I mean. 2007. Yeah. So. Yeah. You got facial hair and you're playing with I eggs on the top of the seven. building. <laughs> well done, mate. Stephen, what's when, this I, when I did it, it was a kid's thing. Yeah, and you took this from a kid. <laughs> and taken from a kid. Um, Proud of yourself. This was in physics class in year it, seven. Okay, interesting. It was actually very similar to what Ryan was doing. Right, like, okay. To uh, protect the egg as we yeah. threw it off uh, the stairs outside the building. Yeah. yeah. And we had to try and protect it from breaking at the bottom. Cool, how would you do that? We did it in pairs. And our team, we had a parachute. Wow. And we had a little box for it. So I came up with this really clever idea yeah. of blowing up a balloon. To, to then glue on top of the egg. Yeah. However, I thought it'd make it more floaty. Yeah. In terms of the physics, yeah. the surface area that hits the yeah. parachute was far lessened because of the balloon. Of course. And therefore it fell and, and cracked. Yeah. But everyone got one of those. Um, all right, I think it's Stephen. <laughs> Who was it? Was it you? <laughs> Fucking hell, what's up? <laughs> wow. Well done. No, it's right. Yeah. Oh, was it? Hey! <laughs> Egg champion, mate. Yeah, egg champion. Fucking egghead, mate. Oh. <laughs> egghead Ryan. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> egg. must Colin become now. the egg. My next big challenge. <laughs> Someone throwing you off. <laughs> it's a fucking dream. Oh, no, it's me. <laughs> Don't it's worry, it. everyone gets a certificate. <laughs> Uh, it's now time for the viewers' most embarrassing moments. Oh, wow. This one is from Anonymous. Uh, a few oh, years fuck. ago, I started watching YouTube a lot more. I stumbled upon a channel called Stephen Tries Podcast, and it was so shit, all my friends laughed at me. <laughs> <laughs> they all pointed and pissed themselves and laughed over the ginger man with the pointy ears. They're not pointy. No. They just protrude outwards. Uh, thank you, Liam. You know, <laughs> there goes your anonymity. <laughs> This one is from Josh Chester. Cheers, Josh. I once went to a family gathering at a local pub for my granddad's birthday. After being there for a decent while, I needed the toilet. The first cubicle I went into was one of the most outrageous displays of a toilet I've seen in my life. I won't go into detail, but you could only imagine the worst. So I thought, fuck that, and moved to the next cubicle and did my business. When I left to wash my hands, I briefly saw another guy walk in and go to that exact same cubicle, look in and immediately turn around. I looked him in the eyes and with chest said, I did that, <laughs> referring to not using the cu that cubicle. <laughs> However, in hindsight, it looks like I proudly took credit for the state of the outrageous <laughs> toilet. I smiled at him and walked out. Still holds me to this day. Thank you very much, Josh. That's, That's my one. stool. <laughs> Oh, never done something like that not like that the no. toilet in TGI's the other night was uh, shit all up the back of the toilet yeah, like a point saying. a point that you you really shouldn't be able to poo on mm. someone did I, it uh, I went in the other day and someone just put loads of chicken strips there yeah. 
ones. Behind the toilet. Like, I'll eat them later. <laughs> like Dave. fully edible ones. Yeah. They're I, gone I now, mate. They're really <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know why. Check the coordinates. Like, it's not like debris. It's not like, like yeah, the no, bits like that you... One, like, really? Take, well. On the plate. Why? Just put it on top of the toilet. They must right. have taken that with them. Yeah, yeah. Who knows? Little toilet Who snacks. Knows? Yeah. No? Speaking of shit, it's, uh, it's not time for this. Fucking hell, I hate this segment. That's right, it's IMAX. <laughs> oh, was it? Yeah. Oh. A bit of anticipation there. I wasn't sure if it was going to be. Yeah. Oh, I, was, I knew what it was going to be. No, yeah. it wouldn't be mine. Yeah, when they were saying it was uh, like it was shit. No, it definitely wasn't mine. I, I thought it was going to be your segment. <laughs> Here's something I talked about before. <laughs> <laughs> your segment's good, mate. Yeah, yeah real good, mate. <laughs> yeah, repeating good stuff, good Bad quality you. content. <laughs> Yours is, shit, yours is shit every time, mate. I don't know yeah, what yours is this week, yeah. but crying. Here's a replay right, yeah. of my best hits, and here's one that Dave said. Ooh. And that was IMAX. Thank you very much. <laughs> Uh, so Max, what have you been up to this week? Aside from touring Europe, uh, just went out for a walk. <laughs> it's always good to. It's always good to go for a walk. Yeah, uh, and just think about the movies. <laughs> and, and people want this cancelled. <laughs> uh, would you work And after every segment, <laughs> just, you know when you go for a walk and you, you just sort of think about all the movies. Yeah, you, watch, you mentioned that. <laughs> that's that's what, you what were you thinking about? Just, uh, the movies, just the, no, not even that. Yeah. I just think about how nice the day was. Yeah. You know, what movie is that? Sorry? How nice the day was. Yeah. So you, so what you just referenced there, you didn't do? Yeah, so you weren't thinking about <laughs> movies. <laughs> you, mean, you can't think of all the great movies. No, I wasn't doing that. I'm not fucking weird. <laughs> That's what you could do. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, it's just having a good time, mate. You know? Really? Uh, yeah. It's an to believe now. <laughs> I had a little snack with me. Oh, yeah. Um, what was it? Just a little tub of, you know, sort of like roses, but not roses. A little tub. <laughs> Oh, probably like a decent size, like a, just a regular size box of roses. Of roses, kilogram of confectionery. Yeah, yeah, we'll go with that. Yeah, yeah. just thinking about <laughs> thinking about the day, <laughs> the weather, just the thing. Was it hot? <laughs> Air was boiling, mate. Uh, you had a you had a <laughs> big tub of chocolate. I had a big, big tub, tub of, of chocolate. chocolate. I guess I had my recorder with me to to, to <laughs> record. Wind, don't you? <laughs> to, rec- to record <laughs> my <laughs> thoughts. Yeah. Yeah. You don't uh, listen to you eating chocolate. And no, no, that'd be ridiculous. No, yeah. and then uh, I bumped into an old friend. Oh, yeah. Did you get chocolate all over them? <laughs> no, I'd never do that. I wouldn't do that to a friend. No. No. Where's the chocolate? Do you want me to press play? Yeah, yes, please. <laughs> wow, what a beautiful day. I've got a box of my favourite chockies, the sun is shining, and the birds are chirping. Shoo, bird, shoo. They're my chockies, mine. Ree, ree. Owie. What was that? Uh, I have no idea. Wow, world famous celebrity Brad Pitt. I see you ventured out to my ends. Must have been looking to get in the next IMAX. No, I'm not a big, big fan of it. Re, I'm mega fuming. Calm down. No, you're being mean, and these stupid seagulls are trying to steal my candy. Wait, did you hear that? I'm not sure. There, the bushes are rustling. Yeah, that's weird. Creamy toffees. What the fuck? Creamy toffees. Brad, uh, I'm scared. Oh my god, it, it, it's getting closer. Hiya. You fucking freak! Shut your fucking mouth! He's coming from a box, Brad. Save me. Oh, uh, what's in the box? Creamy toffees. No, they're mine. Owie! No, you've spilt my toffees all over the floor! Creamy toffees! No, you stupid birds! Take the candy, not me! Creamy toffees! made that segment <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a day yeah so well tough man well done <sighs> the uh seagulls sent me to Paris yeah I continued my day out call it your Brad Pitt yeah oh yeah oh yeah forget about that <laughs> it's forgettable <laughs> 
Uh, Ryan, what did you think of Max's segment? I thought it was really good. <laughs> oh, terrible. Terrible. No, Sorry, don't. What the, sure. what, what the I'm hell? I'm sure he's trying to be the cat. You put uh, me through sorry, a sorry, real... What are you all about? Yeah, no, it was, it was uh, quite funny, yeah. Sort of roller coaster of emotions yeah, you put me through. What's going on here? Sorry if I've caused talkies. confusion. Yeah. Uh, Fuck off, Ryan. Oh, Boo! Yeah. Go on, get out. <laughs> Shame about Ryan. Yeah, just constantly flip flopping. Yeah, yeah. Heads all over the place. Yeah, man. It's a big head. Racist. <laughs> so many places. Big head as well, you know. Hello. Hello. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. What are you doing here? Well, I <laughs> am here because. Well, I'll tell you. Thank you. Sorry, sorry. Who oh. are you before you tell me? My name is. <laughs> Weird. My name is Bill ba- Dildo <laughs> Dildo Shaggins. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dilbo Bilbo no, Dildo I Shaggins. You don't know, do you? Just Dildo Baggins. Okay. What's well. your name, sir? Dildo Baggins. You don't seem sure. <laughs> is this on too tight? <laughs> Um, I have lots of different nicknames that people give me. Uh, Can we have five of them, please? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So there's Dildo Baggins. Nice. Well, that's your name, isn't it? That's like saying his name yeah. is Max Smith. Yeah, yeah, it's not really Max a nickname, that's is true, it? That's true, but some people call me Phil Through Baggins. Phil Through? through. What do you Phil Through? <laughs> Just lots of... Like filter through? Yeah, yeah, like filter through good... Uh, like a conversation. <laughs> who, who gave you that nickname? You must be working oh, on over. I can't wait to meet your friends. <laughs> <laughs> your friends. Yes, it's a yes, mouthful. I've got lots of lots, lots of friends. Lots of friends. Still <laughs> through <laughs> back. <laughs> now you're dildo braggins. Yeah. Hey, and that's the list. Yeah, yeah. six now. <laughs> Is your mum dildo slaggins? Hey, yes, it's very, good. very good. Dildo shaggins would have worked, wouldn't it? Mm. Yeah. Yes. But yes, my name is Dildo Baggins. Yeah, we know. Yes. Okay, no. What are you doing here, mate? Uh, <laughs> oh. I am recently single, looking to go back onto the dating scene. Yes, wow. yes. So you've been on the dating scene before? I have been on the dating scene before. Was what very was good that? into, very good, <laughs> very big into uh, Tinder and uh, yeah. Snapfish. Snapfish? <laughs> no, no Snapfish fish. is where you buy photographs from. <laughs> what are what you what doing? What photographs are you buying, mate? It's the dating scene. Are I'm you? talking about the dating <laughs> scene. Do you, mean, do you mean catfish? <laughs> no, not catfish. There's a, there's a dating website that I used to use all the time. Plenty of fish. <laughs> Plenty of fish. Right. <laughs> Plenty of photos, man. You were just looking at Snapchat, but for fish, aren't you? <laughs> yes. And you were very good at it, were you? I was very good back in yeah. the day when I was a bit younger. Yeah. How old are you? How old are you um, now? Obviously. Yeah. Um, I am 35. Yeah. I wouldn't say that's obvious. And Tinder's not like that old. I mean, I guess if you were Set doing... your age range. Yeah, yeah, if you were doing Tinder, I, I guess you've kind of... You were part of the modern dating scene. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. Mm. I, I, when I started dating my ex, <laughs> Tinder had just started. So... Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. Did you meet on Tinder? Yes, that was, uh, that's where we met. What yeah. was What was their and, name? Uh, um, her name was Janice. Yeah, right. Janice. 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 And what was what was your bio? Right? What was your age range? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking sixty plus. Yeah, my age range uh, back in the day. Yeah, it was a while ago. So, <laughs> Did sure. you die of old age? <laughs> in being. <laughs> 24 she didn't leave you did she uh, 24 plus. Covid was rough <laughs> <laughs> 24 plus yeah, 24 bio would be, plus It was a cold winter <laughs> She was clearly 24 plus <laughs> Definitely over 24 <laughs> Search range the search Easily range 24 24 plus <laughs> Mm. Uh, yeah, but yeah, I was very, very, uh, you know, sh- shagging around a lot back. <laughs> yeah, you're just um, meeting up on Snapfish and yeah. Yeah, <laughs> you dick wet. Um, sure. Yeah. But since my relationship that um, uh, that lasted uh, seven years. Wow, that's a long okay. time. Seven years. Twenty eight when you started. Yeah. Yes. Well, yes. what'd you do? What's your job? Uh, I work for Uber Eats. Right. Um, <laughs> I ride my bike. Clearly. Yeah. Uh, with no handlebars. <laughs> Why? What does that mean? You get uh, stolen. I, I was quoting a song. You're an off character, aren't you? Uh, what song is that? Song, a bloody good one that came out in 2008. <laughs> what is it? Sorry. Um, I can ride my bike with no handlebars. I don't know. It. No handlebars. Surely you've got to, you know, sort of take Excuse more me. care <laughs> if you are carrying food for someone. Yes. Oh, oh I, because I have no handlebars. Yeah. Yes, um, it's more of a unicycle. 
So okay. I put all the food in my, a bike then, is it? My, yeah. on my back and mm. unicycle to my various destinations. So you, you unicycle with no handlebars. Yeah. So does everyone else. Let's say I order KFC at nine. What yes. time would you get there by? About half ten. <laughs> I live right next door to KFC. Everyone else is quick. It's, it's not practical. <laughs> Everyone else is a lot quicker than me, but that's why I'm, you know, d- doing things like this, getting some more money in. You know? I don't, we're not paying you for this. What? No, you don't get paid for this. Oh. Max ordered KFC and you've waltzed up in here. I thought you came on here to, like, get yourself out there back on the dating scene, and yeah, now you're yeah. talking about money. Yeah, well, you know. What is it, it's, it's, all, it's all one thing, isn't it? At the end of the day. Is it? Yeah, relationship. <laughs> Do you, do you deliver Funny. much better in terms of a relationship than you do with food? Uh, yeah, well, yes. My, my relationship that we've just just happened uh, did not end particularly well. Why? No. Um, oh. So basically, uh, a big night out happens with um, a, f- a few of the lads down <laughs> at the oh, pub. Nice. Some of the Uber Eats boys. Yes, yes. And I thought, oh, I'll bring um, Janice, Janice along yeah. with me. Right. Um, Things were going well at this point. Yes, yes, very well. But then they found out. <laughs> it's hard to take her on your unicycle as well, isn't it? Yeah, it, she she did resent me slightly. So is she in the back of the in, in the bag with with the food. No, no, no. So I would pay for an Uber mm. for her mm. to get to wherever we were going. Then I would meet her. Oh, at this, you know, arrange right, okay. a good deal with unicycle there because I always use the bike. Got to make it's not bike. It. It's not bike, mate. Oh, yeah. one wheel, two wheel, three wheels. It's a trike. Yeah. So, so uh, <laughs> dildo. Yes. What What do you look for in a woman? We're just going to cut that story there. Yeah. <laughs> is that it? The big fucking breakup. I uh, I like a woman who is Does vegan. <laughs> You like a vegan woman? A vegan woman? Why? Are you a vegan, vegan yourself? Woman. Yes, yes. But I... you deliver food that isn't vegan, or do you only? Yes, <laughs> deliver... it does make me question my morals sometimes. But I am doing my bit for the environment. What with the unicycle that I'm gonna. Stop have you ever thought? About. Yeah, but you also <laughs> order a taxi at the same time. Yes. If you bought a bike with, with another seat, then you tandem, mate. Would, yeah, you would be mm. helping the environment. I, of course, I, you don't need that now because she left. You. But also, I'm creating well. work for people, and I, li- I like to create work. For people, you could have like a little sidecar on your unicycle. <laughs> Some work for the editor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of things you do to so create work, work for maybe? people? <laughs> well, <laughs> dildo. Has anyone ever told yeah. you have a little bogey there? No. <laughs> <laughs> have I? Have I really? Have I really? No, dildo. That's a little joke. Oh, that's new and understand. Yeah. yeah. So How high up does your head go in that helmet? <laughs> <laughs> what way? What do you mean? No, nothing, mate. <laughs> can, we see, can we see your hair? Yeah, absolutely. Do a lot of women go for this sort of look? Yes. It's like Donald Trump. Uh, yeah, a lot, a, lot, a, lot, a, lot, a lot of older women tend to go for this. Pretend. Look. Pretend. Was, Janice oh, was they're tricking woman, you. Wasn't. Should I say pretend? They're using you to get back in there. I meant intent. Depend. 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 Are they just pretending? Ascend. Ascend. Contend. Ascend. Offend. Apprehend. I'm looking for a woman. I don't think you are. Can we. We go back to that. <laughs> you want a you want a lady? Yes, please. If you had to pick a, a famous person to base your your ideal woman off, who would it be? Um, someone <laughs> like ooh. Mrs. Doubtfire. Oh, 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 she's a good one, but no, she's a man. Uh, yeah, yeah. Too uh, too young for you. Uh, maybe someone uh, Maggie Smith. I like an older woman. Yeah. Or like Shaggy Smith. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. someone like uh, Maggie Smith, but vegan. Um, would you Would they, you marry her? Yeah. So, so she became Maggie Baggins. <laughs> <laughs> but obviously I can't get Maggie Smith. <laughs> no, you could become Dildo Smith, but we already know a guy. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's me. <laughs> Dildo Smith. I think he's all right. Yeah. <laughs> Love you, Dad. Um, real proud of you, man. <laughs> Keep so it up, man. Yeah. I am single. Um, every <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that, mate. <laughs> Not on the sofa. <laughs> uh, your glasses. Uh, have they got real glass in? Or are they, are they for... <gasps> oh, my God! <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> me, you're looking no, at me. I'm only joking. Yes, they're fake, of course. <laughs> you're funny. You I get more it. tips this way. <laughs> tips? Why? Yeah, it's people often tip. And I've got a fucking right four eyes on the unicycle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so but basically what I'm going to do to pick up more women... Is leave my card with every order that I do. Oh, that's not. That's, that's creepy. Yeah. No, it's that's not. Do you know where crazy. they live? Not yeah. creepy. Yeah. Yes, but I, not for long. Do you know how many? <laughs> what do you mean? Because they move. <laughs> <laughs> <Witness> <laughs> protection. <laughs> <laughs> but 
but <laughs> so so you've ordered. I would re- I would leave my cards yeah. to every single house that I go to, even regardless. if they just ordered no, a bunch no, of steaks, no, no, steaks and barbecue wings and stuff, and you're going to leave your card. Oh, you're yeah, so I mean, desperate. Get so their fucking food weird. As well. yeah. Yeah. It's not so, desperate. You know, a house Don't full of player, non-vegans. Don't hate the game. No, boys. we hate the player. Hate the game boys. Hate the game boys. You're a weirdo. You're fucking freaky. Weird. I I didn't like. Didn't like you straight away. I don't like how you need a compass yeah. on your arm to know where to go either. Yeah. <laughs> you weren't work. sure about your own name. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you got fake glasses on. Yeah, well, fake glasses. You know what? I just talking in public. I, Mum, the weirdo I gave me know. his phone number with my happy wasn't meal. Comfortable giving out my name straight away. Why not? You and came here to curse. I'm now out. a single man. I'm vulnerable. What was that nickname I, again? Oh. My coat. <laughs> <laughs> At least we know the helmet works. Why did you pick this helmet? Oh, I just thought it was the most. That's what they said to Janice. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Go on, piss off, Dildo yeah, Baggins. Fuck off. Honestly, it's impressive. Don't leave your card with us. It's just a screenshot of my Tinder. Go on, get, get off on your unicycle. <laughs> I got it from Snapfish. Dildo Baggins, you, you left your unicycle there. Why don't you ride it out? <laughs> 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 oh. It's now time for. Tom Looney. Looney, 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 Looney. <laughs> Hello, Tom Looney. Uh, here, Looney. We are, here we go. Yeah. Looney, Looney. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Devin showed me a funny video this well. It was a video. It was, it was quite. It was quite amusing. I thought. Just of a um, couple of guys. You probably know them. I don't know. But, oh, Will Smith. Uh, oh, I just love like, it. Re- um, Martin Lawrence. Reading out loads of um, things that give girls the ick. Uh, uh, like instant turn offs and some of them quite yeah. funny so I went on Reddit to find a few uh, <laughs> these are from these are from women things that guys do um, and I'll, I'll, I'll re- reverse it next week you know. oh, get, oh, a bit, yeah. get a bit of mileage out of this yes, one yes. You'll, you'll give girls the ick yeah yeah here we yeah, go man. okay some big t- some very, very, oh. very they're very super specific to give girls the ick or guys sorry uh, girls, girls girls don't like big it, tits yeah. right uh, an ex used to say orky mo instead of awkward moment <sighs> Also used to call nipples nippy knops. <laughs> I quite like the second bit. That's redeeming. That's fine. Twenty four. You know, I uh, um, when I first met Zoe. Yeah. I was going through a weird phase of watching uh, the Only Ways Essex, and I answered the door. And pretty soon into our conversation, I said, "What? What? Say? Say? Do? Do?" <sighs> and she uh, she almost left. Really? Very what cringy. That? Gave her the ick. Wow. Oh. Something Joey Essex used to say. Oh right. Um, my now ex-husband began prefacing every sentence with FYI. <laughs> and our marriage imploded soon after. <laughs> a guy I was seeing referred to himself in the third person, but the ick went full blown when he started including my name in it as well. He would say things like, this is a great moment for his name and my name. Oh, yeah. God. So like, this is a great moment for Max and Tom. Why would you do that? That doesn't even make... Oh, that's hideous awful first kiss I ever had I hate thinking about it he literally looked at me and said open your mouth I asked why but, <laughs> but did anyway he just shoved his tongue in my mouth and there were Cheeto chunks in his spit and I almost threw up <laughs> <laughs> that's the grossest thing that's ever happened to me oh, uh, guy bought me the same perfume his sister wore because it turned him on <laughs> Ryan mad respect yeah uh, this uh, lad got his mom got his mom to cut his toenails for him. He didn't have a medical condition or anything. He would prevent that prevent him from being able to do it himself. It wasn't a one off thing. He never cut his toenails. Uh, his mom always did it for him. That is that is definitely Dave. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent Dave. <laughs> These two are grim. <laughs> <laughs> One's worse than the other. I'll start with the oh. not so bad. When he would be flossing his teeth, he would pull the floss out and then put the floss back in his mouth and eat whatever came from out between yeah. his teeth. <laughs> No. <laughs> this, is, no, this, this is the worst one. Oh. I've got more, but th- this one now is. <laughs> okay. I went to give him a BJ and there was a chunk of poop stuck on his pubes. <laughs> what? What? No! How does that even happen? <laughs> Loads of them were like about hy- like hygiene. Guys are disgusting. Oh my god. Some of them gosh. are awful. How is there a guy with poo on his pubes getting a blowjob? Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, man. Oh, one more. One more. This one's not little, so bad. Little yeah. p- palate cleanser. Yeah, little palate cleanser. <laughs> First time we hooked up, he grabbed my ass and said, Give me that cake. <laughs> <laughs> That's not bad. That's yeah. not so bad. I feel like I went for some really disgusting ones. There were some that oh, were quite funny. Filthy. Uh, yeah. yeah. Filthy men. Yeah. yeah, maybe the poo one was too much, wasn't it? It's now time for Ryan's Crying. And if I'm not mistaken, we have a bloody good jingle. 
Hello there, my name is Ryan Locke. Send him off! Send the dressing gate off! Get him off the field! That was diabolical! Get him off the field! That's just typical what he is! Get him walking! Get him walking! Welcome to Ryan's Cry. Get him walking! <laughs> Here's some things that make me cry. Uh, firstly... Oh. Hey Ryan, how have you been? Yeah, good, thank you. Oh, why are you doing the segment there? Ryan's crying. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, these, the, these are just things that annoy Get me or that I don't agree with. We, we know the score. I don't know the score, mate. Number Two one. Now. Are you right. winning? Controversial. Controversial. <laughs> Scrabble. That's it. Don't Scrabble. like it. Don't well, like you're it. dyslexic. It's understandable. Oh, right. Well, I was... I was I like most of your writing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Left-handed. Why didn't so like, like, like yeah. Scrabble, Rome? Oh, I don't know. No. Okay, next so one. Much work. <laughs> no, moving past Scrabble. Okay. No. Um, <laughs> no, sorry, so go on. Have you ever played Scrabble? Yeah, a few times and uh, never win. Who are uh, you against? Do, obviously, do have dyslexia. It does make things harder because I cannot picture the words. Yeah, right, it does. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you like keep a little piece of paper and like write them and stuff? Try writing combinations. Like, uh, at least fucking try. Don't be like, oh, okay. Well, I, I, it would be a much longer game. Yeah. It's a long game anyway, Scrabble. You, you don't play Twister. Scrabble to, you know, play Scrabble. You do it's it to not, have a it's fun time. Cool. Yeah, it's like, it's an evening, you know. You it's have a, a rainy day. I play to yeah. have a couple of beers. You and, oh, I guess, you know. You're off ill you with your nan. Partner, you know, yeah. You sit down and. Huh? I was just giving other scenarios when I've played Scrabble. Off ill with my nan. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing contagious. Mm. Except the love of Scrabble. <laughs> hmm. Got uh, a toaster at the moment. That yeah, won't... boy, I said yeah. you're good. <laughs> <laughs> you allowed him to doesn't uh, doesn't toast a whole slice of toast though. oh like, do you need to do take it to the top. bath with you <laughs> you fucking yeah. man only toast half the bread so uh, I pop <laughs> it down I put all off it better to turn it round it'll pop up and I have to rotate it again then all the middles always burn have you just you got a shit cheap one. toaster <laughs> yes yeah, I did we'll get an expensive one yeah, get oh alright mate my one just costs 100 quid yeah you don't need to uh, hurt our ears with your fucking shit yeah man <sighs> fucking boring alright next up then in the oven luggage racks on any form of transport Right, I'm talking plane, train, automobile. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Spanish football team. Uh, they're just not. Just Welcome like to em. automobile. <laughs> uh, even on a plane, when you've got it up above, I hate having yeah, to go man. into your rucksack. Like if you need to get something out of it, and like it's just the awkward. Yeah, but otherwise, it's around your feet, and everyone's isn't it? looking Hockey at you. Oh, maybe I like that sort of thing. <clears throat> and then trains as well. When you put your suitcase in, you've got to walk half a mile down the. Train to half a mile. I don't know, mate, because not, you know. we used it when we were coming back with a wheelchair and it was perfect. It was just, you know, tucked away. Yeah, but that that, <laughs> that luggage rack saved us. We, we got lucky. <laughs> they there. were just moving out of the way for you, weren't they? Yeah. <laughs> not paying for this seat. <laughs> uh, but they put me on edge. Luggage racks? Yeah. Put you on edge? Yeah. Well, Leaving right. my r- luggage there. I'll always just take it with What me would you say to a luggage rack if they were here today? Be better. Wow. Could you give it an instance of how they could do that? Just maybe security, get a... Uh, you want a security guard on each luggage rack? That's not practical. <laughs> that really isn't practical. A lot of jobs, though. Yeah. Uh, We've got too many police on the streets. Let's get them on the luggage rack. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan's law, we call it. What's in your luggage that's maybe, so worth protecting? But just my stuff, you know? <laughs> maybe there's Name like three things that tags, you can't afford to lose. Right? There's a tag that's on the <laughs> luggage. Not on your ankle, though, isn't it? It's on the luggage and it's on you. And that yeah. luggage can't get off the train without... You, it's like two tags. Like someone tried to, oh, someone no, tried to lift my case. So is the, that the, that the and the security go. guard? And you want to put this on stagecoach? Everyone's got these, you the know, futuristic field. tags. Yeah, yeah man. But yeah, well, getting Squid Games, yeah, but fine no cues. So because yeah, no one wants to get on these weird trains. <laughs> <laughs> You're attached to your case. More, more no one's getting my undies. <laughs> more security guards than actual passengers. <laughs> <laughs> There's no room for you. We've got fill it with security guards. <laughs> There's been no theft this week. <laughs> Even on a plane? Uh, a plane, yeah, I mean, yeah, not not, not the tag system for a plane. That no. we, uh, That's good of you. All the security. Yeah. No. <laughs> it's now time for Put It To The Max. Put it to the max, to the max. Put it to the max. I literally got my nard snipped so we don't make any more fucknuts like our son Billy. Ooh. So, what? Just seen our Did son. Did you say hello or anything? I'm, I'm bathed in my mouth, LMAO. The irony of my dick pushing out the biggest piece of shit that is our son. 
These are but a few of the texts my father has sent me <laughs> when high on his post vasectomy painkillers. <laughs> I'm fuming, but I don't know what to do. I don't. I, I don't know what. I don't know what to do. Daddy may be horrid, but he pays for my schooling <laughs> and the roof over my head. Love you guys. Have a sick one, Ben. Can we hear it again, so please, gonna... Ben? Can we hear some of the yeah. oh sorry. some of the text messages, please? I'm mm. so confused. I literally got my nards snipped, so we don't make any more fuck nuts like our son Billy. <laughs> Ooh, just seen our son and barfed in my mouth, LMAO. The irony of my dick pushing out the biggest piece of shit that is our son. <laughs> <laughs> what, why was his dick put out of sperm? Yeah. yeah. It does sound like his dick shitting a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Right. Weird dad. Weird dad. He is weird dad. dad. That's not yeah. a nice thing to Nasty say. Nasty dad. Yeah. Horrible dad. He's, who, I wonder who he was messaging. Probably a partner. Yeah, wife, probably. Mother. Yeah. 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 Oh, unless he was like. Oh, yeah. Sorry, th these were texts that dad has sent to son. By accident. By accident. By accident. Because he was oh, high on his yeah. vasectomy pills. Famous vasectomy pills, yeah. Yeah. Um, so did he have an issue there? I think he didn't know what to do. Because his dad's Because like, like, oh, yeah, like, if your dad's having a go at you, yeah. you obviously want to say something bad. And he's paying for your schooling. You know? If he's paying for your life, yeah. yeah. Ryan, do you ever worry that you've let your dad down? No, no, not at all. I think I'm sure. very proud. Oh, you'll get that one line <laughs> <laughs> if if your dad did criticise you yeah how would you react uh, stop texting him for one yeah, yeah. And then wow. just say nah dad don't want any more of your food that you make me what does he make you just so he does some baking sometimes because yeah, you've only but seen him like once once a year don't you like you're kind of baking times. yeah <laughs> are they proud of uh, proud of that yeah, yeah, they yeah. Uh, they they don't want me to leave Manchester uh, ever. In their opinion, they don't need to come back. They don't need to come back. <laughs> <laughs> so proud, man. You stay there. <laughs> I heard from an agent you're getting that one line very soon. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'd just speak to my dad if I was really angry with him. Should we act but, that out? Yeah. So uh, who must be Ryan's dad? Is it? Is he sent me these texts? Yeah, he well, he's, he's just yeah. He's annoyed with this. I don't know. I think you would. Nah, I think you're Ryan's dad. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Should be Ryan's mum or brother. I can be mum. Yeah. Oh. I'll be. I'll be your brother. Okay. Right. Dad, you've been sending me some weird texts, making me out to be a twat. Making you out to be a twat. You do that yourself. You can. Uh, <laughs> how? How do I do that? Well, everything you fucking do and say. Right. Well, do you think? Look at your forehead. Do you think it's appropriate to be saying You're right, twat on not to, Dad, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Thanks. You're my favourite son. Yeah, it's not. Yeah. That is, Dan. Weird. Probably looking at Mum. Yeah. I'm up here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mum, <laughs> Dad's, Dad's been sending me some really rude messages. Go on. Uh, he's just been saying that I'm a piece of shit that's come out his knob. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Funny, I? <laughs> uh, doesn't, it's not Be fair. comedy. Ha Harry doesn't get any texts. Oh, Harry's a good boy. <laughs> we like Harry, don't Harry's we? Harry's not shit. He's yeah. a good son. <laughs> All I'm trying to say is just stop texting me rude stuff and stop being a dick to me. I don't think I can do it. I is there anything wrong with you, Daddy? What are you trying to suggest? <laughs> yeah, that's not cool. What the fuck are you trying to suggest? Why are you questioning Dad like that? Why are you looking at me wrong like with that your up father? and down? <laughs> saying I'm sick. I just said, there's no way you would have sent me that, that text without, you know, You're really, really meaning. Did you do it deliberately then? <laughs> there must be something wrong with me to have you. <laughs> You're right. Right. So maybe there is something wrong with your dad. Fuck me, maybe there is. Maybe there is. Fucking hell. Oh shit, I should go to doctors. Why are you sniffing your fingers for you? Has he been with you again? Foul. <laughs> yeah. No, it's an nah, no, it's I know I shouldn't. Wife. I know I shouldn't. Uh, you know. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't deserve it. No, he doesn't. You should do it with Harry. <laughs> no. <laughs> Finally, have to wait till I'm thirty. <laughs> Life's cruel. <laughs> maybe when I'm thirty, I'll come to Manchester. Yeah. After I've had me fill. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, thanks, Dad. <laughs> for what? Uh, just for, for nothing. <laughs> Rude. Harry, mm. good luck. Thank you. Mum? We'll need luck. I'm up here. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there we go, Billy. Uh, Ryan has perfectly displayed how to uh, yeah. just leave home. Yeah. Didn't like the bit where he sniffed his fingers. No, no that wasn't weird. cool, mate. Yeah. But it was method, kind of, wasn't it? You yeah, went yeah. checking yeah. for a He's bringing stuff from his own life in, and it was like <laughs> yeah. trying to help Billy. Oh, this, isn't, this isn't about you. This is about Brandy. Billy, yeah. Yeah. You're up there on you, the plane. I thought again, you were there. Yeah. yeah. I thought you were like that uh, Tom Shelby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's now time for the final question. It's the final question. 
Would you rather eat a handful of hair or lick three public telephones? Like the actual, the, the receiver? Yeah, man. Or the metal bit where you push the numbers in? Oh, I reckon the buttons. The button, okay. Oh, God, that's even worse. That is worse. Yeah. It doesn't say whose hair. So it's just un- hands full of hair. Unnamed yeah. hair. You have to do that when your mum doesn't hair. shave. I, I'm going to go for the buttons. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. They're not choggy buttons, hey. Tom. <laughs> la, 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 la. To be fair, public oh, telephone yeah. choggy buttons would be horrible, wouldn't it? <laughs> Where'd you get them from? Oh, it's fucking right. <laughs> not if Willy Wonka made them. <laughs> public telephone won- Wonka buttons. Choggy buttons. <laughs> I think oh, I'd go for the buttons as well. I'd go for the hair. Switcher. Yeah. Mm. See, I, I don't think I'd be able to get the hair down. Yeah. Hand, handful of hair. I think I'd really struggle with it. Just gag. It, I hate having hair in my mouth. It, yeah. I'm not one of my worst things. Like, But licking the buttons. Yeah, I just I, I do You're it. You're going to get a disease from that. Straight for the Listerine. Um... And then just kind of be done with it. Hopefully, I don't get sick. I'm yeah, worried I'll get a taste gonna, for it. I'm gonna have to lick the telephone. <laughs> it would overpower your saliva. Oh. It'd be so dry. Yeah, I'm gagging. Like, you couldn't get it down your throat. It'd be. Oh my god! Yeah, so and I then just think of the poo beef. afterwards. Yeah, Harry oh poo. yeah, that could be quite funny. That'd be yeah. nice, wouldn't <laughs> it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Giant second ball, fair ball. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, like I'd be shit. I mean, the buttons coughing bad. up a fair ball. That'd be bad. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But the thing is, I've seen horrific things in in telephone boxes. Yeah, we hear some of them. I just like people pissing and. <laughs> I'm going for the buttons as well. Yeah, oh, but uh, I've just it's so horrible. Eyes. Like if if you're in the film uh, the phone booth mm. where he's trapped in the phone booth and the guy's got a gun on him, yeah. he said lick the lick the buttons three times. I'd be like, okay, yeah, yeah. I'm out of here. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> you fucking weirdo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm at the buttons on your coat. <laughs> I'm at the jockey buttons. I, I, said, the I said only three times. <laughs> 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 I say you. Yes. <laughs> I would say looking the. I'm going to be walking down the street now and looking at yeah. every telephone box going. Could I do it? Even if like it's not like it's not. I'm not saying they've got poop on them. I'm not going. But it's like clearly like some like crusty bits and stuff. And if they would though. Yeah, that's so what it's I mean. like they some would. crusty bit, a bit of blood on there. Too. Have you been in a telephone box recently? They stink Ryan a piss. Yeah. Ryan's been in a telephone in. box. Yeah, yeah, not long. Couldn't ago. get him out. I would. Yeah. <laughs> I would eat a handful of hair. What? <laughs> I'd have the handful of hair if it was if it was taken from from there. Oh God! Free city. <laughs> <Just taking from there. laughs> it's not a lot then. <laughs> they, I'd bite that hair off. <laughs> <laughs> Just ha- ha- I'm not a fan of hair at all. Like anyway, yeah. like you. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> we don't get on. <laughs> you said my legs got well hairy legs. Yeah. yeah. Are we need to tell the doctor, doctor in Turkey about that. <laughs> we all licking buttons. We're all licking buttons. We're all licking buttons. Na 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 na. na. And uh, well, thank you very much for watching the Stephen Trice podcast. What was that? <laughs> so, uh, I'm I'm I delirious like, from yeah. Yeah. poos. Uh, I've been joined by Ryan Locke. Hey, Ryan. Uh, Tom Looney. And Max Smith. Uh, cheers, guys. The Smith. So the call him. S M I T H. Yeah. Smith. Max Smith. He was a character. He was. He was. Barely. He lasted just a bit longer than the one today. Anyway, stay safe, stay humble. Ciao.